So I got a free refrigerator. Not quite sure what's wrong with it. Take it back to the shop, clean it up a bit, and start the troubleshooting process. It doesn't take us too long to figure out that we are not hitting the appropriate temperature. This should be about 40 degrees colder. So take a look underneath the hood and try to find leaks. Once we throw a piercing valve on here, we figure out the system is flat, which means we've got a leak somewhere. So we're gonna pull out the process stub and put a proper port on there. Check the nameplate real quick and the design low pressure side is 140. So that's what we pressurize it up to and we find a leak. The leak is where the evaporator transition between copper and aluminum. So we're gonna use this Alco epoxy stick. First thing we're gonna do is RTFM to figure out how it works and then just follow the instructions. As you can see, it changed color like it's supposed to. Pressure tested again and check for leaks. Looks like everything's good to go. Gonna throw some UV dye in there and get it to our target temperature. Once we're satisfied with the fix, we're gonna button everything back up and we're gonna be done with this project and on to the next one.